Hi, I'm Pete from PD Customs. Today we're gonna work on something a little different. I'm gonna work on this camping trailer. I gotta remove all these decals because they're old and faded and we're gonna put, mask them off and we're gonna paint them instead of putting them back on decals. So I'm gonna paint these back on. So I gotta remove the decals and then we're gonna paint them. Later, we're gonna paint the front panels of this because the paint is coming off, is very worn and aged. So. We're gonna revive this old camper, so follow along and I'll remove all the stickers. That's hot. Is this not time consuming at all? You're not gonna talk dirty to it anymore? No. I turn on the camera. It's so not, it's. it's family friendly, you know. I may have been telling it to come all. I, I wasn't allowed in my prom. How about you? I didn't go to mine. I went to my wife. That's hot. Was that last week? No. Oh, you, I never mind. That was the other couple. I, I, I got you mixed up. Sweet. <laughs> okay. Oh man, I got this on my. You don't like this? This is like almost like one of the worst jobs. It I'm really not a big is. Fan of this at all. This takes forever. That's hot. It's just plastic. No, it's tin. It is? Yeah. Dude, It'd be easier. Is it clad in something? It, it's probably electric coated like that. Oh. Like, you know what I mean? It's like siding. I guess if it was plastic, it wouldn't dent like that. This could be somebody's home. Yeah, if you were in Polo. Polo? Outskirts of Independence. Is that where uh, in Excelsior? Barn Garage is? No, Polo's north. Ah! Biscuit eater! That's hot! I think I just made up a new cuss word. <laughs> Biscuit eater? I don't even know where that came from. It just came out. Like I had the, that one thing. What's that one thing I'm talking about? Um, Tuscarosa. tornado. Testarossa. Something like that. No, that's not it. That's a Lamborghini. Testarossa syndrome. Oh, is that real? Turret. It's Turret. Bullshit. Does Michael Jackson have it? I don't think Michael Jackson has anything right now except worms. <laughs> really? He invited me to his house once. Get some Jesus juice. Oh yeah, would, was it Pepsi or was it Fudge Pops? Pudding Fudge Pops? Oh, wrong guy. Oh. That, that was Cosby. Wait, who's Cosby? Bill Cosby. What? Philip Morris? Do you think he actually, maybe he, I think that he was like alluding to this whole time. He, I mean, he ran a gynecologist uh, office in his basement. We did? Was yeah. it legal? I mean, it was on the TV show. Cosby show. The Cosby show. He was a gynecologist. Obstetrician. Shut the front Dude, door. Dude, he was in the basement. You didn't Shut know that? Shut the front door. He's looking at snatches in his basement all day long. Yeah. Legally, that's weird. You know, you know that that's one of those jobs that sounds all awesome. You're like, yeah, I get to look at it. Yeah, until you see a pussy. Until, yeah, you, yeah. And she's like, I don't know why it's dripping green. Can you look at this? <laughs> I don't think that. And you're I, like, I hate my job. Yeah. I don't know why you'd want to ruin something that you enjoy. <laughs> yeah. I think. I think. I don't know. 
think I want to say something that's not kid friendly. Or YouTube friendly. Or Feet Finder friendly. <laughs> Is there rules on Feet Finder? I don't know. You would know. You're the expert. Well, I, if I, there was, I'd break it. Well, you have an account. Don't you? Just, Is that you have? You I, have like ten times as many I followers started, on that. Just because I started an account doesn't mean nothing. Till then, are you are you hating? Your yeah, your OF account are only you feet. Hating? Are you hating on my feet? I have bunions. What? You like my feet too? She likes his feet. I don't know if you guys heard that. She said, hell yeah. <laughs> I think you're going to have to edit out what she did just say, because that was not kid-friendly. <laughs> this is your camera. I know. I figured so, because you wouldn't have went and got your own. Mine's, mine's, I'm still in your internet. So I can, I can, uh, I can upload it? my masterpiece to the, the YouTubes. They're all waiting. I know. Bated breath. Yeah, all your fans. Yeah. All six of them. <laughs> They're waiting there's to like, see. There's like six people going to watch this video of mine. <laughs> Maybe eight if they if I tag you in it. You have more You have more subscribers than I do. <laughs> but you're not out here pick, oh, <laughs> picking <laughs> stickers off. Oh. <laughs> uh. This is real body work, and this is what it is. Picking stickers off? Little shit like this. I freaking hate this. Like I said, you just throw some Bondo over it, and you'd like be like every other fire. YouTuber. They done one of, I don't know, I don't know. You can't get views unless you hack stuff. You have to hack stuff. People want to see you hack stuff. They don't want to see you do it right. Don't ask why. They don't want to. They don't Even if it takes the same amount of time is what's crazy to me. Even if you had to do it six times and you did it wrong, that, that's what they want. They'd watch it six times too. You got most of it off though. Compared to the other side. The other side is less sun. Did that come off all easily? Oh, they took that off. Oh. This, this side looks better. That side's fine. That side will live to see another day. This side is not. I haven't debated. I haven't figured out if the heat gun, if the heat works better or not. Tearing it in little pieces, not fun. All right, I'm back and it's day two and we got all the stickers off and all the glue. So the side's ready. So now I have to get this front ready for paint. So I have to scrape off all this old silicone. And if you have never used one of these super scraper, this thing is amazing. You could get it from, I got it from Mortski. And you should probably go check them out. I'll put a link down to Mortski's YouTube channel on in the description. So go check out him and what he does. And his super scrapers are pretty awesome. So I'll get this front scraped up, cleaned up, and ready for paint. We had a little bit of rain, so we're back and sun's shining. Hopefully no more rain so we can move on today because I'd really like to get this painted today. And so now we got all the caulking scraped off all the way around. And what I'm going to do now is wipe off the adhesive. There's still some adhesive left from this decal and go over all the edges and clean it. The rest of the caulking and glue and whatever else is on it off of the surface. So we can move on to sanding but first we have to get that removed normally i'd use like a prep saw but really this is damaged and we're repainting it so it's probably just going to remove the paint 
but if it removes the paint, that's fine. We're gonna go ahead and strip it properly because it's very thin. By the time I barely sand, it's gonna go right through. So we'll go ahead and get that cleaned up now. All right, so here's my problem. This sticker looks like crap. It's a safety sticker. It's about pilot lights and propane and explosions and stuff. I don't like explosions, but also kind of can't remove that. I don't have them to replace it. So what I'm going to do is try to clean the edges up to make it look better. So like. a little better a little straighter I mean there's not a whole lot I can do with it but I can try to make it look a little better I'm going to 320 it with a DA, which is a dual action sander. It's pneumatic, air operated. bright I'm gonna have to go get some glasses
Got a long ass blower. We're gonna use that to blow it off. There's a faint line of where it used to be because it's glossy, the pattern. So what I gotta do is mask off the pattern so we can re so we can paint them instead of putting a decal back on, which will last longer, look better. It's gonna be the easiest for me to do right now, but this will help make it look normal again. All right, follow along as I mask that up. I got it masked up, so now we scuff it. So we gotta scuff all the areas that need painted. So we masked it all so I can scuff inside there and then we can plastic it and move on and hopefully paint it soon. All right, it's windy as crap and I'm gonna attempt to cover this thing in plastic, mask it all. And the wind just dies down like right now, but it does pick up, so this might be worth watching. Got it masked up and I'm gonna wipe it with wax and grease remover. That and a microfiber spray on wet, dry it off. Epoxy through a Tecna copper.
Uh, the epoxy dries, we gotta let it flash for quite a while. It takes, it dries very slow. So we're gonna move on and I'm gonna spray the maroon. I just made it up. I took some old maroon and darkened it to make it closely match to what color was on it before. Let's put that on. Now I made the brown color. I just made it up out of scratch, used some leftover paint, added it, darkened it, put a little red in it, put some black and red in it. So close enough. <laughs> 